All right, we've got a final checklist. So I gotta fix the loose wire, air up the tires. I think I'll just change the battery. Fill the uh, transmission oil, fix the center stand, oil pump. Oil pump's not working. Drain gas filled with premix, just carb. No, we will change battery, not charge it. Check oil level. Oh, see if there's any two stroke oil in it. Petcock. See if the petcock's leaving or leaking. Try to start, maybe ride if I'm lucky. And if so, another assessment. So uh, that's what we got left. Off camera, I, what did I do? Uh, I fixed this wire. The seller had screwed that up. Um, I hooked up the old battery, but I'm probably just going to swap that out. Open says me. So there's the old battery, or the battery that was that came with it. And I will, you'll notice. The negative and the ground connect down here with that bolt. Fine, handy work. Camera work there. Oh, and then the center stand. There's actually half of a broken bolt stuck in there. Uh, you have to get lower to see it. but So I'm trying to drill it out. You want to see that? I bet you do. At least I'll get a little bit of it on film. The drill, ooh, I got a, my battery died on that drill. That's right. Full strength. There, you can see the bottom of the center stand I got off. And then there's a top that it mounts to. And uh, for those who are curious, I'm down here trying to drill out this remainder of the bolt. So, you probably don't want to sit here and watch me do that, so I'll inform you of the progress momentarily. All right, after much drilling, actually less than I thought, but still quite a bit, there was uh, the broken off piece of the uh, bolt that was stuck in there, and I just drilled through it and finally drilled it out. Here's the... Uh, I don't know. I'll call it the center stand mounting bracket. Yeah, it's a mess. It's a dirty, oily mess. Uh, I want to just get it back on, but I also want to... I'd like to clean it off, but I don't want to be here all day. Let's just scrape off some of the goodies. We'll get back to it later. Oh, yeah. What a mess. Oil and sand. Hope none of this got into the engine, right? Always run an air filter. Always run a rear fender. That's what I say.
Oh, and I found a uh, workaround for the bolts I need. I mean, I'll get the bolts later, but for now, uh, just to, for starting purposes only, I've got some uh, cylinder studs, and these work uh, pretty well for just uh, screwing in and holding it down. So, uh, I can at least secure it until I get the proper bolt. You know what I mean? And then, I was, I was thinking about this. Uh, one of the things I wanted to check, make sure the petcock doesn't leak, is uh, I've never, I've not been able to find uh, uh, an aftermarket new petcock for this. Um, I guess you could find some new old stock OEM ones. But uh, there's some guy on eBay who sells a, a QT50 petcock. And he claims that it'll work on an MJ50. And let me see here. I'm just going to call, yeah, I'm going to call a big bullshit on that. Uh, because this pet cock, although... This has got two lines going to it. I wonder if you could just make something work. It doesn't screw into the bottom of the gas tank like the QT50 Petcock does. This is just, it, it holds onto the, kind of the frame and then it's got a couple lines running to it. So, uh, I wanted to mention that. Oh. So I'm going to get the center stand back on and then drain the gas, adjust the carb, add some pre-mix and try to start it. So I'll be back. All right, initial carburetor adjustments. Oh, I gotta squeeze by. I gotta squeeze by. Okay, I'm gonna come up behind you here. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, so on this one we've got the uh, idle air screw here. I've got it all the way in. Um, some of these carbs are a little different with the idle air screw being uh, on the other side of the throttle stop screw. But here's the idle air screw and we're going to go I always like to use a flathead because it's easier to count. Half, one, about one and a half out. And then on the throttle stop screw I will go half, one, half, two, half, three. Let's try three and a half. It's just a guess. We'll see how it ends up. So there's the carb. Oh, I got to drain the gas. Um, I just got to put the uh, spring on the center stand, which I'll do on the ground and show you that with the uh, Travis tutorial voodoo center stand spring magic trick. So you can learn stuff watching these videos. Um, what else did I, oh, I want to put air in the tires. I'm not going to mess with the battery now. It's hooked up. Uh, so we're getting closer. Stay tuned. Oh, that doesn't want to work. All right, will they hold air? They're a little, cr yeah, that one needs replaced. Ain't no doubt about it. Well, 
Now we need your place too. Oh yeah, we got cracks everywhere. Whoops. All right, let's boogie. 